Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. NV4 Flatline. Epic. 70 plus kill massacre. Are you ready to be entertained? Are you ready to be entertained? Oh, well, welcome to the Dean Zone. I'm out here, players. I got that epic weapon variant known as the Flatline. Because when I pull this thing out, all my enemies is going to need to be revived. They need to be rushed to the hospital. They're going to need something CPR, defibrillator, Ben, help these dudes. <laughs> What's going on everybody? It's your boy Jimmy Dean again. If this is your first time to my channel, welcome to the Dean Zone. But if you're one of my subscribers, or you've been here before, welcome back! <laughs> and you see it. But hold on, before we even get into this, look what these dudes try to do to me at the beginning of the game. Oh, he tried to rush me from the left. He tried to come straight ahead at your boy. Oh, is he trying to flank me? Hold on, scuff jump. Go to sleep, player. Then take your homie with you. <laughs> Look at that. Them dudes tried to rush me at the beginning of the game. They had a plan. They had a dude come from the outside of the map, dude rush through the doorway, two of them come through the back like they was attacking. They had the full court press on your boy. But don't they know I'm a savage out here? They must not know when I had that flat line because I'm a flat line these dudes. But before we get into the game, pray anything like that, right? Let's talk about this gun, the flat line. NV4 flat line epic variant. Now I've brought y'all a lot of epic variants. And I've never bought y'all the flatline. Now, I made a beta video about the flatline because I was lucky to get it in the beta, right? And since then, you see, notice I've never, ever made a video about this gun. I've done the chaos two or three times. I've done, you know, I use the Fallout because I go hard to paint with it. It's one of my, the MV4 is bay. That's one of my favorite guns in the game. But I've never used the flatline because I never unlocked it. I never felt that there was an absolute reason for me to unlock this gun. Right, like I already had the chaos. I played with the gun before. I use the flatline most of the time, just in case I slip before I accidentally get a deatomizer when I'm not even trying. Those I love those games, but this gun, like, there's a reason I've never got it, right? Because my, like I said, my favorite gun is the MV4, but I didn't feel like I needed this gun. I didn't feel like this gun gave me anything that I didn't already get from the regular MV4. Now let me tell you what the gun comes with, right? Before we get into it, like, here's the description of the gun. It's a full auto ballistic rifle with moderate fire rate, increased stability, which is best in class. So it shoots slower, which also increases the stability. So it has less kick. It doesn't, I mean, like it's a laser. But the gun itself, the MV4, is already a laser. Now now that they've nerfed the gun though, and gave it more, a little more recoil, a little more kick, then I felt like, ooh, as I hit him with the phase shift, hold on. Surprise player. Ooh, one, two, three piece, let's go. I ain't done. Ooh, run up and get done up. Hold on. I said run up and get done up. Oh, 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 oh. these dudes that wanted with your boy. Like I said, but since they've nerfed the gun, I was like, you know what? I can tell. A lot of you can't tell. They say you can't tell the difference. And the, hold on. Ooh, as I hit him with the jump moves, I had that dude shook out of his socks. I was out here hitting him with that. Ooh, don't run up on your boy. But like I was saying, I had that dude with them Kyrie Irving moves. He wasn't ready for you. Look, Spire Sense is still going off. Why is they still coming at me? How many times I gotta say don't run up on your boy? I'm in this room holding it down like a boss. So expire since it's going off again. Who else wants some of Debo? Why do they keep running up? Do I need a sign? Do I need to make a sign? Look, gotta get up out of there. Look, I run into the dude with the shotgun. Your boy was on a tear. I was on a massacre. Look, you see, I was heated. All right, all right, back to the gun, right? Back to the gun. We'll get into the gameplay. All right, and this gun also. So since they nerfed the gun, right? Who as I dropped the beat on the boys once I'm jumping to my score streaks. But since they nerfed the gun, I'm like, you know what? Maybe that will come in handy. Because I know the chaos, I love the chaos now, because it shoots slower, so therefore it's reduced recoil. But this one, this gun right here, it personally comes with attachment, which is focus, which reduces auto sway while aiming down sight, and it also has precision. This is key, this is what makes the gun epic. Precision, infinite damage range, infinite damage range at a reduced fire rate. So it shoots slower, but your damage range is infinite to infinity and beyond. They got me out here like Buzz Lightyear and I'm trying to light these dudes up. Which means this gun, no matter what, is always... Who is a phase again? Hold on, am I still playing peekaboo with these dudes? Go to sleep! Go to sleep! I said go to sleep. You can't avoid the kill feed, player. But like I said, this gun is infinite damage, so it is automatically 
a four shot kill anywhere. Whether I'm cross mapping dudes up close mid range no matter what. So this is the most dependable weapon in the game. No matter what you do to it, no matter what you put on, you run around with suppressor, you want to be a ninja, you want to be a ghost, you want to stay off the radar on the mini map, this is the gun. It has no effect on your gun whatsoever. You can be a silent assassin, a killing machine. You are the ninja. This is your dojo. And when they step up in the building player, oh, you got to lay them dudes down. You got to hit them with that Bruce Leroy. You got to catch the bullet in your teeth and tell them who's the master. And when they say who's the master, you say flat line. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. I'm tripping. Well, look, so it's four shot kill anywhere on the map, right? And with the reduced fire rate, and it also has reduced recoil, I mean, why not use it now? It made this gun so much more viable. Ooh, look right there. You see, I just got saved by the bell. I was falling off the map after I killed the dude in the last second. Come on, man. Hey, that's why I knew luck was on my side, right? Because I'm just out here grinding. All I'm trying to do is complete my mission teams and play for the W. You know how your boy gets down. But just when I was about to unlock this gun, I was like, all right. I get the uh, free rare supply drops from the uh, season pass. I open it up. And oh, look what your boy got. I got the flatline for free 99. I swear I was going to the going there to unlock this gun. I was about to spend the 4,000 salvage on it. It is what it is. So I, then I ended up getting it for free 99. So I knew it was a sign. I knew it was a time. I knew the Call of Duty guys were telling me, Jimmy, you're right. It's time to pull this gun out. It's time to make this gun a factor. It's time to make this gun even more potent than it was intended to be. Because with the nerf they put on the MV4, player, it makes it so much more deadly. So much more viable. And it is 100% the most dependable gun in the game. I ain't messing around. Matter of fact, let's bring that beat back when I'm back into my score streaks. The grind is real. You see me? I've been out here laying these dudes down. I've been melting these dudes. The MV4 is, is, is bae, man. That's bae. Me and the MV4 go together like peanut butter and jelly. You feel me? If you don't like peanut butter and jelly, player, we go together like, I don't know, Adam and Eve. You feel me? It is what it is. Whatever you like to put together, put it together. It go together like the kill feed and the beat. It go together like the score streaks and me manually controlling them. Man, it go together like Call of Duty. You feel me? <laughs> so what I, I tell you to get this gun if you ain't got it? Yeah, go ahead and get it, player. Go ahead and get it. If you want the most dependable weapon in the game, the most reliable, the most consistent, it should be called the MV4 Consistent because it is the most consistent killing machine in the game. You know what you're going to get in every gunfight. You know how many bullets it takes to hit, kill, you know everything. There's no guessing game with this. Some weapons, it, the range changes if it's a 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 shot kill. This thing is always the same. It's always the same. It's your homie. It's your best friend. Hold on. As I transform like Optimus Prime in the Robo Dean. Let's go. The only thing I can depend on when I play Call of Duty is this MV4 flatline and that kill feed. One to two things is going to happen. I'm going to get my kills the way I'm supposed to get my kills and I'm going to see my name all up in the kill feed. If it's there more than once, player, I'm doing my thing. <laughs> but when it comes back around the corner, trust me, I'll be there waiting for it. It can pick me up. I'm ready to go for a ride just like I'm about to take these dudes on an epic journey. An epic journey. And you know who that journey is going to take them? It's going to take them to the kill feed. They need to rush them to the emergency room. These dudes need shock. They losing them. They ain't got no more pulse. They flatline. It's, that's why it's called the flatline. Because you go in these dudes. You know how a little counter goes up when you see them in the hospital or in the movies. And they pulse going up and down. And when it flatlines out and they gone. Player. That's the name of the game. That's the name of the gun. And you know how I do it. Oh, if I ain't owning my enemies. Look. look I don't want to have to drop the beat. I had to drop the beat. Look at me. And this camo, this camo is sick. Yo, I got it. It's that new Call of Duty one they had in there. Hold on. Ooh, you see me fall back? C4 sandwich. Come on. I passed out the C4 sandwiches. I wasn't trying to eat none. Ooh, one, two piece. It melts dudes. And it's a ballistic firearm too. So it shoots. See how the bullets kept going and shoot through another person. Man, if I'd have been using like the Type 2 or that new Exeon, I wouldn't have been able to get that second kill off. It is what it is. But I'm able to get that beat back off again as the grind continues. Man, I be getting little baby streaks. Ooh, am I on the relentless? Come on, man. What am I doing out here? I'm just out here messing around. I'm just out here kicking it in the Dean zone. Trying to drop knowledge on these boys. Trying to put my enemies to sleep. Trying to carry my team to victory. Making sure we're doing the things we're supposed to do. Is that another warden? 
man. Will it ever stop? Oh, they jumped your boy. They jumped your boy. But it is what it is. You see me. Look, I'm back on my grind. Now I'm just waiting for the W. I haven't checked the score. You see me. I don't get any score when I'm on the net kill feed. I don't never check the score. When I'm grinding, I just do me. Now I know I got a lot of kills. Ooh, go to sleep, player. Mike Tyson's punch out. Even the butt of the gun is deadly. Even the butt of the gun is deadly. <laughs> but like I'm saying. Once I know I've been getting my kills, man, that's it is what it is for me. I'm over with. I know I done wrecked these dudes. I know I went hard to paint. All that's left for me to get the W. Ooh, as I hit the phase shift on these dudes. Hold on, you looking for me, player? Here I go. Peekaboo. Hold on, wait a minute. There's two of y'all. Go to sleep then. Why is these dudes always having sleepovers in my games, in my lobby? You didn't invite me to the sleepover. You didn't be like, hey, Jimmy, we about to have a little party. We about to kick back and sit over here, take a little nap. Tell ghost stories? Nah, player, I am the boogeyman. I'm the dude you're telling ghost stories about. I'm the dude that's under the bed. It's that night quill man. <laughs> and you know the beat can't stop if I keep dropping streaks. Come on. Oh, one, two, oh. I love when they jump me. You know what? I love when they jump me. It's the price I pay, man. Being a solo player. You know what I'm saying? It's a part of the grind I get used to. You see, I just keep moving. I just keep calling these streaks. I keep pressing the pace. I'm just here for the win now, players. It don't matter. I'm out here trying to get my score. I got to get my rank up. All these new prestige. It is what it is. Oh, just like that kill feed. Oh, I said just like that kill feed. <laughs> this was definitely the Dean's room today. I don't know why they came up in there. They didn't have a reservation. They come in my room trying to eat. Player. It is what it is. But I hope y'all enjoyed the gameplay and the commentary. I hope y'all enjoyed the gameplay and the commentary. Because like I asked you in the intro, were you ready to be entertained? Look at your boy on the ESPN Top 10 once again. Let's go, man. Matter of fact, you know how I do it. Let's just ride out, players. But that's it, y'all, man. I'm out. Peace, love, and hair grease. One. Oh. And if you like the video, like the video. Like the video? Jimmy, I love that video. You was going hard in the paint. 70 plus kill basket. What'd you even finish with? I see you going hard. Look at all them badges. You was out here only these dudes. Hold on, what? 74 kills? 74 kills? I was watching the game play. I was sitting in the stands. I was cheering. Go, Jimmy. Go, Jimmy. Go. Go, Jimmy. But I didn't see all that. Did I miss something? Man, I gotta go back and watch this again. 74 kills? Oh yeah, I know how you did it, Jimmy. You did it quietly. Ha <laughs> ha, Dean Zone.